Good evening, everyone. As you all know, we've been through a very tough year. And this evening, I have a little happy news, a little joyful news to share. Um, it will make us, I think, very proud. Um, here in our parish, we have a young man who received a letter recently. Um, and it's about him, but it also affects us very personally. The letter is addressed to Mr. Christian Galdi, and it reads, Dear Christian, it is my honor to notify you that you have been selected as the Wachong Hills Regional High School recipient of the New Jersey Somerset County School Boards Association's Unsung Heroes Award. Each year, Somerset County High Schools are asked to identify a member of the senior class who exemplifies good citizenship and volunteerism. And this year, you have been identified as that person. Enclosed with this letter is a certificate from Somerset County School Boards Association. There will be a virtual recognition program in the spring that will feature all those selected in the county. Your nomination came from your school counselor, Ms. Riddo. Ms. Riddo shared with the selection committee your commitment to the fire department and your place of worship. In addition, this community volunteer work, I appreciate the time you give to the Wachung Hills Regional High School marching band and track team. I'm confident that you will continue to contribute to the community after graduation in all endeavors you undertake in the future. Congratulations and best wishes. Signed, Mrs. Beth Scheidemann, Super Acting Superintendent, and a CC to the Board of Education President, the Principal, and the School Counselor. And you might say, who is Christian Galdi? Remember when this, this pandemic began, we started videotaping the masses, and you heard that little phrase that our video and then eventually our live streams were being handled by Gal, Galdi Rock Studios. And Galdi Rock Studios is named after Al Galdi, one of our parishioners, and his son, Christian. Christian happens to be at the helm this evening at our, our live stream station. So Christian, show the camera so they can see who you are. <laughs> Christian, put yourself on uh, the camera so people at home can see who you are, okay? Your father gave me permission to embarrass you tonight, just so you know. Okay, sorry, Al, they mean sell it down the river, but you know, it's a time like this where we, where we always, it's good to remind ourselves and to remember that even in the midst of some hardships and heartaches and tough times, it's a cliche, but it's so true, there's always a silver lining. Christian has been by his dad's side for over a year now, helping us to get the mass videoed and now live streamed out to the whole parish. And it took Christian a while, but he finally got his dad trained enough that Al could be by himself a little bit, and Al could take a and Christian could take a little break away. But um, so and of course the the other beautiful thing is the fact that Christian is a member of the Millington Fire De Volunteer Fire Department um, at the tender age of are you 18 or 17 still? 18. Okay, he barely can drive, but he can drive a fire truck, I guess. But anyway. So we are very proud of him. He's one of our, one of those, he's one of those sons that every mom and dad would be so proud to have. And I know Chris and Al are, are tremendously proud of him. And Christian, I just want you to know as your pastor, I personally am very proud of you. And our parish family is very proud of you. And thank you for the example that you extend to our younger members. Um, even though I have lots of long, long homilies, you sat through lots and lots of homilies over the years from all different kinds of preachers. And it's, it's very obvious that the gospel values that his parents live, that his family lives, have obviously sunk in. I mean, what 18-year-old get out of bed at 3 in the morning to go and, you know, put out a garbage can fire or, or help somebody in distress? Um, that's, that's vacation. Um, that's a heart that's really uh, moved to service and to, to care about the neighbors. So, Christian, accept our thanks and our gratitude for you. Thank you. Thank you. 